Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another video, and on Genesis, you can actually get some really awesome loot in a certain way. It's a way that a, a lot of people have forgot about. Now, <clears throat> before I do this at all, I'm going to mention the fact that yes, this is a boosted server. It is the server that I am running, just so you can see that. It's a uh, comprehensive building over overhaul, all that kind of stuff. So, um, basically there's a whole bunch of people on the server. I'll leave a link down below if you'd like to join. I think it's like seven or eight times loot that we have. So it is higher, but, uh, this is how you get some really awesome loot. If you go to the coordinates right next to where the fishing mission is, which is give or take 69, give or take 20. And, uh, you have yourself a sit in one of these chairs. There are loads of saber tooth salmon down there. Now you do have to actually catch them but I'll go ahead and kind of talk this through and show you an example in order to get a hold of any form of saber tooth salmon you have to fish with a, the better the rod you have which you can get some ascendant rods from killing mosasaurus uh, squids stuff like that the higher grade loot you get now also the larger the size of the fish the better the grade of loot as well so you can see right here that I have a, just a ton of fish clustered together one kind of cool thing about saber tooth salmon is if you punch one of them, they will all congregate together and follow you. So you go down under the ice, you punch one, they all follow you, and that's why a couple are dead, and you swim up through one of these holes, and they kind of get stuck in the zone. Now when they get stuck in the zone, they literally can be fished for hours. I only have 14 um, leech blood, but obviously you get the point. I can fish for 14 different fishies, assuming I catch them all, and you get some awesome loot. Now for those of you that didn't know this, yes, you do get BPs from this. Um, fishing is actually one of the best ways to get BPs in the game. A lot of people forgot about this and they don't know about it, but a couple of the tricks that you can use. If you are not a fan of like just watching, you can actually K mode under the water just to see all the fish under there. And it will still let you actually fish while you're doing this, which is pretty cool. And it'll show you when the fish is about to go bite. Oh, like literally right as they did it right there. That's kind of unfortunate. So. It takes, I think it's 45 seconds with this. So I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna leave it right there. Wow, that's a lot of fishies right there. Um, basically, I'll take a screenshot just so you can see. Uh, this method just causes all the fish to get stuck like this in this, at least in Genesis, because these holes, like you can aggro them straight up and then saber tooth salmon have a tendency to swim straight down. And you just pull them all to one spot and you can do this with like seven, eight, nine, ten 10 people around here because it's all time-based. It does take about 45 seconds and then they will bite. I'm going to go out of this mode so you can actually see. Um, but you can see there's fish down there. The larger the size fish, the more loot you get. The higher the level of fish, the more loot you get as well. So there is actually increased ways to get loot. So you can get a small one, get lower loot quantities. Higher one, heavier fish give more loot. But that's kind of like real life. You know, the bigger the fish, the more stuff you get out of it. Now we just gotta play the waiting game. This is kind of like the roughest part. I'll show you guys a couple examples of this, um, this fishing style, and I'll speed through them once I actually catch this first one, so that way you can see the loot that I am getting on this. Um, but on one times you can still get some pretty good loot off of this stuff. It's randomized, but I mean still, some loot's better than no loot, and especially on like two times weekend or any boosted server, this is one of the best ways to get loot, no matter what. And there we go, so A, E, W, S, and the larger the fish, the harder it is to catch. So you do have to keep that in mind because there is a timer on this thing. And if you don't hit that timer, you actually don't get it. Oh my goodness, hello. Before I continue to... Yeah, what the heck? There we go. So, look at that. Now, obviously, this is a boosted server, but I got a ton of BPs right there. That was a 1,200 Dura fur piece. So that'll be nice to have. Yes, please. Thank you. And uh, I think... I can see, yeah, there are other people fishing here as we speak. You can see one dude over there. <laughs> so this is a really good way to do it. Actually, um, that's actually a cool picture. Let me take that picture right there. So, and it's just a 45 second thing. So I'll show you one last one and then I'll kind of do a couple in a row and speed through them a little bit. You know, maybe just so you guys can see. Um, I'll slow it down a little bit, but I'll speed through it a touch. Um, Again, a great way to get loot. That wasn't even a big fish. You can see that monster fish right there. I'm hoping he bites next because he will have some absolute monster loot for me. Same, same thing works on official. Um, I've gotten... I don't think I've ever gotten really anything super OP. But I've got uh, Mastercraft and Journeyman. Cheap, affordable, 
um, and ease to make saddles, which is nice. So that's definitely a good way to get loot. So this is a great way to start off, especially because it's so easy to cluster him and it's such a safe location. Because there isn't a whole heck of a lot of stuff that's dangerous other than like Therizinos in this zone. So this is definitely one of the best ways to get loot, in my opinion, of course. So I'm sitting here waiting for some BPs. Please. Please. Come on, give me something. BP farming. Oh, there we go. So there's D, Z, S, A, D, A, C, W. All right, guys. So I decided, and I, I did a couple catches, and then I realized, you know, it might make it more believable if people actually get to watch me reel these things in because a lot of people would be like, oh, this is not true. So it does take about a minute per fish. And I'll kind of like, you know, talk you through some of this stuff. So if you've already gotten the point and you're like, yo, I get how to do this. Thanks, teacher. You're like, oh, blah, 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 whatever. Cool. You can leave now. I'm kind of just going to do some fishing, um, mostly because I enjoy it. And I guess I'll just, you know, keep keep chatting because that's what I do. That's kind of like me. That's me. That's teach. All right. So um, I'll catch one more fish and I'll show you the loot that I've gotten so far. And uh, then I'll keep keep fishing as we go. Uh, there's a couple different ways to do this. Um, I, I kind of prefer one certain method where you do K mode underneath and then it makes it a lot easier because you can kind of, well, it's kind of stressful when you're like looking down you're like, oh, I don't know what they're going to bite. Uh, K mode, it allows you to actually watch under the ice and I'll show you that right now like this and you can see when they're going to be reeled in, which is quite nice. And just like that. So, and you still can do the whole thing if you want to call it that. Um, and it makes it easier because it's less stressful. So. And you still get everything, so it doesn't change that fact. Ooh, that's actually a good blueprint. This is what I'm looking for. Yes, please. And is that a... Oh, it's an Argentavis saddle. So, whoa, Mosasaur saddle. Okay, that'll be nice. And we're just going to keep doing this. Boop. And I haven't caught any of those big ones yet. Uh, as you can see, they sit down there and they don't bite very fast, which sucks for some reason. Or maybe it's just like the little ones react faster. But if you bring enough leech blood and you've got a couple hours on your hands, this is a... Oh, hello. Hi. Hello. This is... Hello. Care to join me? There. So, it doesn't matter if there's like 12 of us on this hole as long as there's still fish down there. Uh, you catch a ton. There's just a load. So hopefully he joins. I don't think that we'll have an issue with it, but we'll see. Um, there you go. So he's going to go ahead and sit down and join me. All right. Is he like whistling his Rex or something? He's whistling something. I don't know. I saw a Rex earlier, so we'll see what that is. Yep, that's a Rex. It's kind of scary when it comes from this area behind you. <laughs> Uh, so if you do want to play on my server, I'll kind of tell you a little bit about it as we go. But um, it's PvE during the weeks, so that way people can like you know do their jobs and all that kind of stuff. And then on weekends, it is PvP, so that way there's still some fun stuff. And you don't have to engage in PvP. We're working on a solution for that right now, and we'll kind of like figure that out as we go. Uh, so I think this fish is going to bite at some point in time once it actually figures out how to get close enough to my <laughs> my bait. Oh my goodness! Come on now. Do, do this. Oh, there we go. Right. Z, Z, S, A, E, E, X, D. Boom. Okay. Procoptodon, Mosasaurus, and Dire Bear Saddles. I am not complaining about that. So you see, he's got the Ammonite Bile on there, which you can get from killing certain things and as like a, from the store. And Ammonite Bile does work for fish. Um... I'm pretty sure that's what he's got on there. I can't tell. I'm using leech blood. So, I don't know. I can't, that certainly looks like ammonite bile to me. I think it is. We'll see. I think his is the same time as mine. So, they're both 45 seconds. But they're also guaranteed to catch Sabertooth. Whereas not all baits are. Oh, there's his. I think his is doing his little swimmy thingy. Yep. And let's see if it catches on to him. Come on. Bite his bait. Bite his bait. I saw you do it. Bite his bait. I want that huge fish. If I can get that huge fish, I will be super happy. Oh, there he goes. So you can see that he's got his fishy. And uh, he just pulls it out of the water pretty easily. 
Wow, he's, he's really good at typing because I am not that good. Both of us are just sitting here taking the fish. I think I'm going to lose my... No, I can take a screenshot. We're good. Cool. Look at this. There's two gents taking ourselves a fish trip. <laughs> Come on. Give me one more fish. One more fishy, 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 fishy. Here, fish, 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 fishy. Oh, there we go. Alright, Q, S, C, W, Q, C. That's a small one. A, Z. Hey, Pelagornis, Diplodocus, Argentavis. I'll do one more. But as you can see, we're kind of just cruising for our little fishing mission here. And uh, I'll take a screenshot if he gets one so that we can get a good little picture here. That's a big fish. I hope that one of us catches that fish. I honestly do. So, anyways, um, hopefully this helps you guys out a little bit. And other than that, teach out.